Well, so here we are at the VW Amio launch. Now, what is this car all about? Essentially, it is a compact sedan which will rival the Maruti Suzuki Swift Desire, the Hyundai Accent, as well as the Tata Zest. And uh, it is a very competitive segment that this car is entering. It is a car which is, of course, the sixth car now in that compact sedan segment. But what VW have done is a very smart thing. They have really loaded this car with all the features. Even the basic version comes with all the features, including airbags as well as uh, ABS. And you also get the choice of cruise control, among other things. Let's have a look at what this car really is all about. Engine options include the 1.2-litre three-cylinder petrol as well as the 1.5-litre four-cylinder diesel from the VW Polo. In terms of gearboxes, there will be a five-speed manual gearbox as well as a seven-speed DSG automatic on the 1.5 diesel. Well, the Amio has one of the better uh, boots in this uh, segment. Uh, the aperture is really wide and it's not very high from the ground, which means you can load in those uh, big boxes without too much fuss at all. It's also a very wide boot and very well shaped, which means uh, you can throw in those big golf bags without any fuss. So one of the better cars for uh, big luggage carrying capacity. Well, so here I am in the backseat of the Amio and uh, remember this car is based on the Polo hatchback and what that means is that legroom is just about adequate, headroom is decent and you get this huge transmission uh, tunnel over here which means that whoever's sitting in the middle will really struggle for uh, legroom but that said uh, the seats are very supportive, the backrest angle is very good. Well so even though the rear seat might not be the most roomiest in this segment, in terms of sheer build quality the Amio is well above all its rivals. Well, so here I'm in the front seat of the new uh, Amio and this car, remember, is based on the Polo. So you get the exactly same dashboard uh, and you get a lot of features as well in this car. You get ABS as well as airbags as standard. You also get optional cruise control. Now, this will be the first car in the segment to offer cruise control as standard equipment, which really is a very good thing uh, from the house of VW. Uh, you get this huge glove box, which is also air-cooled. You get very supportive seats and uh, you also get this very bright uh, beige fabric, which really does uh, add to the sense of uh, roominess as well as comfort inside this cabin. So in terms of uh, overall materials as well as practicality, one of the best cars in this segment when it finally goes on sale towards the second part of this year.